All right, guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. You guys know we had to get this one in. Uh, I'm going to take Jiren into... I mean, I think I consider the Gogeta fight a little tougher than Janemba. Um, Janemba can get a turn where he... Like, he can hit harder. But I think Gogeta is more threatening. Because Gogeta is going to pepper the field with super attacks. Whereas, you know, we're going to see Janemba do one every blue moon a lot of the times, right? Uh, Jiren is a really good character. He is very underrated, but I think it's probably mostly just because he's not on global yet. I think that's more so what it is. And, um, I, I think once Jiren comes out, I mean, if he comes out in a way where global players are able to summon for him easily, um, I think that this is going to be a very respected character. This guy's good. Um, you know, he does, of course, have one of these standbys. A lot of characters oftentimes fighting for the standbys, but... In this guy's best setup, unlike a Universal Survival Saga team, we're not going to encounter that issue, right? Like, he is the only standby right now. We're jumping in like this, full Universe 11. Universe 11 is not so weak of a team that we're going to have huge difficulties. Never mind. Okay. Well. Um. Hmm. Not a fan of our rotations, I would say. <laughs> I would say I'm not really a, so much of a fan. Oh, boy. What do we do? I mean, we should probably get Topo in slot one right here. I, I guess, I mean, this is good for me to see Topo as well. Because right now, I'm making a priority. I'm working on my uh, LR tier list first. But then we got to jump into the TUR tier list after that. All right. That's probably not good. That's probably not good. I've got bad news, I think. I'm pretty sure. I've got bad news. Yeah. All right. Uh, it's not. <laughs> it's not April anymore. <laughs> okay. Uh, I mean, to be fair, what does Jiren do there exactly? Nothing, right? Like he couldn't help that. A tech Jiren is not eating that either, is he? I don't think so. Uh, well, kids, that's why we give our characters a certain ability, which, um, can allow you to get through bullshit. Now, luckily enough for me, I do have infinite Jirens. All right, let's try and get a little bit of a better first start right there. Uh, we may need a little luck to get through the first. I might have, uh, bitten off more than I could chew. We could just do double Jiren. Yeah, I picked a really tough fight, didn't I? <laughs> for this. Alright, maybe we'll go to just... We can do double Jiren for Universal Survival Saga, I guess. Because... Slot 1 at the start of this fight is a little bit of a nuisance for us. Now remember, once Jiren gets to his standby, he is truly invincible. Not invincible in the way people think a lot of characters like maybe like Tech Broly are. But Jiren is actually factually truly invincible, as in 100% damage reduction. This is a friend Jiren, so he's going to have no dodge, right? Yep. Not even Link level 10. Not the biggest deal ever, but a comment I can make. Yeah, 6. It's just not a good build for winning, man. Uh, Do we run Margarita in slot 1 right here? High chance to dodge. Another 20% chance to dodge since there's a Universe 11 ally. And she does have... Well, she does have 30% damage reduction. Nah, that's in slot 3. Alright, we're gonna have to do this, man. Aye, aye, aye. Alright, well, let's just... Let's do just a Universe of Survival Saga run. Um, and I think we'll come back to this. Okay. Okay, cool. Normals will kill us. If you're curious. Normals will kill us. <laughs> so we do need to make sure we're dodging. Margarita. Oh, okay. Ah! Uh, we, we could come back to this. It's just turn one is where this guy is at his strongest. And Jiren turn one is just like a very strong, like, tanky slot two character. Which is cool in principle. But if Gogeta just decides to attack before we do, what are we doing? 
and that's exactly what we're seeing. Let's just run Universal Survival Saga instead. All right, guys, we'll line it up just like this. Um, this this way, we're looking good. Um, I've seen some people begin to turn a little bit. What? <laughs> what? What? Huh? God damn this game, dude. God damn this game. God damn this game. God damn this game. Ah, uh, okay. Well, uh, I could say this. We do have a nice build for winning. I could give him a different uh, silver equip. I could swap that into a three additional four dodge. Right now, that's a four additional three dodge. I could swap that around a little bit, but I mean, he's... All right, let's see. I... Man, I don't know. This is just a tough... You know, I. there's a difference between the best characters in the game and characters who are not quite the best characters in the game. Jiren is not quite the best characters in the game. Okay, no super attack. That's good. Um, all right, we're, we're, all of a sudden, we're in business, though. We just got one little bit of luck. Remember, this is an attack break right here. Yep. That could have been the super right there. 17 and Golden Freeze that cannot be killed in slot 2 and slot 3 most of the time. Remember, this would probably quantify as a very underrated LR right here. This character. Um, I mean, they, again, they are... It's just like a slot 2 or a slot 3 thing, which has limitations. I mean, at some point, you need a character to go in slot 1, or you need super luck. One of the two. This is double digits. They have 100% damage reduction. Oh, we did. So, okay. We had... <laughs> okay. We had 100% damage reduction right there. We were fine. He, he, he couldn't do shit to them. The dodge is obviously not for turn one of them, but, like, for, you know, subsequent turns. All right. Um, we definitely did not attack break the super, but he could have. Do we just do this right here? I think so. Team Universe 7 shouldn't be in any danger, right? Nah. Plenty of rainbows right there. Perfect. Uh, by the way, I'm going to give Tech UI Goku his own video. Um, where I'm kind of making him the focal point. Like, I didn't want to just, like, not run him, but I, I you know, I'm, I'm going to make him the focal point of his own video. Again, as I've said many times, I'm doing a lot of videos right now. I, I'm not, like, rushing into making this tier list because, I, as I say many times, occasionally people go, like, oh, he's just bait. Like, I actually take it super serious, the tier list. Like, I, I don't want to put up bullshit. I, I really, like, sit and think on these very hard, and especially with, uh, this is, double digits right especially with like adjustments post worldwide new characters you know some new tough fights you know things change like i, I don't want to become a victim of the past of oh five months ago this character was so elite obviously he hasn't fallen off like well no things change right situations change um a character like cell max right his restrictions are now becoming a, a, a definite issue with, you know, the way the villain, the best villain team or core is kind of constructed. Um, and, I, I mean, in these fights, he could be wiped out right away. But in what I would consider the hardest fight in the game, Selmax is still one of the better options you could run. So, it, it's, you know, again, things change. Um, by the way, we could get rid of Gogeta's ability to block melee supers. Um, but that's obviously not going to happen until turn... Uh, it's, well, it's going to be turn seven at the minimum with the domain because i floated him uh let's just get jiren out so there's several different ways we could use jiren's standby let's transform and then i'll talk about it Now, the biggest reason I'm so high on this character is this, right here, Jiren's standby. This is what makes him truly elite. I think a lot of people, like, when I've seen people discuss Jiren, and I saw someone like this comparing Jiren to Beast Gohan, which is a little silly, in my opinion, at Beast is way above him, but um, Jiren, like, like, they use arguments about, like, full power Jiren. I, I, I mean, I don't want to say I hate full power Jiren, but I'm not really as much of a fan of how they designed him. Because what the, what they did was they just designed another, like, slot 2 or slot 3 character, typically. 
I mean, he could get, like, a scouter out and stuff like that, but he's not really built for slot one. I, I They should have had him guard his first turn um, as well. Like, we'll, we'll talk about... We are going to, obviously, use full power in this video, but we'll talk about it. So, AGL Jiren right here, if we get five orbs, he has 100% damage reduction, which means it is actually impossible for him to be killed. Well, I guess... Like, if we would have one HP on the turn, and, you know, he would take, like, you know, 11, like, double-digit damage, like, 11 damage or something like that, right? It is possible to take zero damage. Um, I re I think in a video recently, Beast Gohan took zero. I should make that a short. I gotta find that. Um, so, what we're gonna do right here, because we have AJL UI Goku in rotation, I'm just gonna leave AJL UI Goku right here um, to take advantage of his 100% dodge. Well, I don't know... Gogeta's probably going to super right there, though, huh? Because there's two different ways we could play Jiren. In my opinion, the best way to play him is just to use him as a slot one, typically. But on Universal Survival Saga, we've got, you know, in Evolution Blue Vegeta on certain turns. We have AJL UI Goku on certain turns, Tech UI Goku. Like, it's not like we have a, a weakness of characters that we could put there. But, you know, Jiren could go in slot one with 100% damage reduction. Or we could leave Jiren in slot two or three. And he gives all allies 70% attack for two turns. So I think what I'm going to choose right here is let's use Jiren in his support role. So, and remember, Jiren does create EJ orbs. And it's getting orbs is what, um, you know, sends him into full power Jiren mode when we want to do that. So again, right here, uh, Jiren is giving 70% attack support to this rotation and to the next rotation. Yeah, we. it's like... I, we, I, I did want to put Jiren in slot one, but, like, again, he literally factually has 100% damage reduction. He cannot be hurt outside of taking, like, 11, like, 50 damage or whatever the hell it is, right? Like, the bosses can't touch him. Um, I've found it to be fairly consistent to be able to get his orbs, too. I've never really had much of a problem. I think it's because the teams we're going to be using Jiren on typically aren't struggling for key as well. But, right? Like, it's usually not, like, really too much of a struggle. As long as they get their attacks in right there, they'll be fine, even if Gogeta supers. Again, 17 Golden Frieza are a very elite character. Like, Gogeta cannot kill them. Might be able to do some damage, maybe, I don't know, 300k, 200k, something. But they're very good. 17 and Golden Frieza. Very good character. No double super, okay. Um, we'll, uh, we'll put Jiren right there in harm's way. I'm not sure. Uh, he probably would be killed. Would he be killed? Because the thing about Jiren, I mean, he works a lot better, I, I think, if you just have probably one on the team because of the whole standby thing, right? Like, we can't turn the second one into the standby. Um, but Jiren, on his first turn... Gets the attack break, which we'd really want. L let me not hide him. I mean, we're here to see how Jiren can do, not hide him. I'm going to pop Evolution Blue Vegeta's uh, active, because he's he could build up a little bit more. 449k defense. Let's see what his defense jumps up to after this. Yeah, exactly. He wasn't fully built up. Alright, um... We need rainbows for seven or for universe seven. Damn. Only one is all we're gonna get. Alright. That gives a little bit of support right there. Alright, no super. Uh so Jiren has sixty one percent damage reduction, but I I mean, I don't know that that's enough. It looks like we're going to kill Gogeta. At the end of the day, this Gogeta... And oh, no, yeah, the, the nullification. Silly me, silly me. At the end of the day, like, this Gogeta and Jinnima don't have enough HP. If they had double the amount of HP, these fights would be really fun. Okay. Super. Let's see it. Friend, Jiren, zero dodge. Let's see how we do. This is, this is probably death. This is like 4 million, isn't it? Because it's a type disadvantage. Yeah. 
So base Jiren, not going to be able to handle that. Okay. I mean, obviously, I could have put Team Universe 7 right there. We'd have been fine. But, you know, remember, these these videos, I, I usually am prioritizing, let's see how the character performs first off, and then we can worry about, you know, like, winning afterwards. Because it's, it's very, you know, I, I will always push back against, like, oh, this character is actually so good. And you go, why? And then they'll just re reply with a screenshot of a, of a win. Oh, damn, you got me, guys. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, never mind. That character's top five, actually. One screenshot win against, like, Blue Gogeta. Supreme Magnificent Battle. Holy hell, dude. That's crazy, man. That's nutty. It's nuts. Uh, now, Jiren... Yeah, okay. So, he, he is gonna be a little susceptible in base. He does have that attack break as first turn. Alright, this run... Let's just play to win this one. Um, how do we want to do this? I guess we'll just do this right here. That's what we'll do. Uh, again, remember, Jiren is going to attack break. So, Gogeta specifically would need to be supering with his second attack in slot two. In order to... And, I mean, he, he could kill Jiren. He'd slap him for a lot, a lot of damage. I think we'll probably get a W in this run. Um, and then I might give Universe 11 another try. I think once we get, like, established and we get one of the Jirens transformed, we're good. Um, in order to transform a Jiren, it's just a second turn. All right, not a super attack right there. Perfect. We very well may have attack broken Gogeta super right there. If he, if Gogeta doesn't super, I'm going to say it was attack broken by Jiren. Yeah, because remember, Jiren's transformation condition... Just think of it as his second turn is what Jiren says. Because it's third turn from character's entry turn. So you just think of it as Jiren's second turn. Yeah, Jiren absolutely attack broke. So right there, that was value. Jiren definitely attack broke the boss super attack. All right, well, unfortunately, I mean, maybe this is a little... Damn. I, certainly this is a little unimpressive by Jiren. Yeah, I mean, I mean, look, look like... Okay, I'm glad I, I did put in Broly in front of Jiren in, in that tier list I made. I'm glad, I'm glad. Because, like, we get one fight that's designed a little bit like this. And look at the difference between Jiren and, and in Broly in here. And obviously, as we transform into full power and stand by Jiren, he's elite. But, I mean, I do really like my characters to be able to come out of the gate and look very crazy. I feel like... Like, the Carnival Gohan and Goku Gohan and Trunks, I can give a little bit of a pass to because of, like, I, I, their heights are, like, Goku Gohan and Trunks just drowning the team in a huge defensive buff. And then the family Kamehameha has a true team protector mechanic, and it's called kill the fucking boss before they could do anything, right? Which is factual because it's an active skill. Attack before the boss can attack, right? You can only say kill the boss before they kill you if it's an active skill or standby attack before the turn starts, then it is a true statement. You can kill the boss before they kill you. Otherwise, the boss dictates because they always attack first since that one. Another super attack dodge here. Awesome, dude. The build is working pretty well for them. Let me show their build. We, I think I have additional primary and dodge secondary on them. I think so. Yeah, I just... I Please, guys, expand your minds a little bit with some of these builds. I know I, I have done great work. A lot of people really have accepted that, like, okay, yeah, the, like, it works, it works, it works. Like, like people are like, okay, like, shut up. Yeah, we got it. Like, ooh, like yes, we're all saying it's good now. Shut up. <laughs> like, if, <laughs> right? All right, let's see what the build is for them. Yeah, 20, like, that, dude, that's perfect. That's perfect. And we got the raw defensive equips. I highly recommend that for them. Absolutely. Very good. Um. Okay. So, I think what we're going to do here... Uh, it's a pretty quick animation. We could just play it again. Sure, why not? I mean, this is your own video, right? Okay. So, we have Jiren out. Let's go ahead and just toss his ass in slot one this time. Oh, wait, no, but I want to... Damn.
No, I'm not gonna. Just because I really want to take advantage of the support. This is still only 80% damage reduction here. So, let's see if I regret this. I don't think I'm gonna, though. Jiren is pretty tanky. I wanted to get the Rainbow Orb support. I really wanted to get it for 17. Team Universe 7. Um, because I do think they'll live Gogeta pretty easily, but I just want to make sure Team Universe 7 we're, we're helping them as well. I don't think I've ever had Standby Jiren get killed before. I don't think so. Dodge, perfect. Oh, okay. <laughs> sure. No super attack anyway, though. So we had, um... 83% damage reduction is what Jiren had on that turn. 83% damage reduction, I believe. Because he gets 11% uh, damage reduction. No super? What? Yeah, because he gets 11% damage reduction per Keyster. Oh, how about that? Sure. Again, we'll just toss Vegeta's active. Get him in the middle slot just to make sure that all, as many links are up as can be. Mm, I guess we could kill on this turn. Damn, actually, I'd really like to get full power. Dude, we got to get full power Jiren out, though, dude. And we're not. We got to get full power Jiren out, man. Goddamn. I got to get, well, I gotta get G full power Jiren in the video at some point, man. It's just that, I mean, he's a double transformation character, right? Perfect RNG means we could turn into full power on turn five. Um, I think we need to get to 29 charges. To transform into full power Jiren? Oh no, it's only... It's 25. 25. 25 charges is all he needs to go into full power Jiren. So it's not really too much at all. Uh, because one thing about this team is... I mean, well, I, we could run like 17 and 18 as Rainbow Orb changing, but like, they suck. Um, we could run Blue Cow, King Goku, and Evolution Blue Vegeta, but... I... I mean, they real Against Gogeta here... You have to respect Gogeta, man. I mean, he can double super all over the place. That's why I think that this fight is, is harder than Janemba. Because he has a higher super attack rate. He has a lower cooldown. Right? Like, he he can double super. Don't kill. Do not kill. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Perfect. 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 Yeah, we're fine right here. We eat this. They're living easily. This character, they're not bitches like that, sorry. Whew. Whew. No, god damn it, dude. No, man. No, wait. No full power Jiren, dude. No full... We're... God damn it. I guess I shouldn't have given 7, 18 Universe 7 those orbs. Ay, ay, ay. You guys want to see something funny? Here, let's do this. Nope. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Block it with my face. Uh, okay. Yeah, damn, dude. Orbs have been a major issue in this video. I guess we're just getting unlucky. I mean, this is only 70% damage reduction. 72% damage reduction. That's not a good idea. We could do this. I mean, I guess we'll play this in the video. Uh, we're just going to revert back to base, though. Uh, Dokkan has made huge major issues, like, huge issues, by the way, having, I think, those failed, like, you never see those, those failed, like, transformation, like, you never see that shit, man, so, I, I, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I really want a full power out right here, but whatever. Um, you never see those failed transformations, man. I guess th this is, like, maybe the first time ever that I've actually done a failed, like, transformation with one of these standbys. And we've gotten, like, true value from it. 
27 by base Jiren right there. God damn. 27. Like, imagine if we had... He'd have been above 30 if we had the standby Jiren and, like... Like, if we had him in slot 2, standby Jiren in slot 3, we'd have been above 30. Damn, dude. We're 25 minutes in and we haven't gotten full power Jiren out, though. I, like, I, I, I gotta... We gotta do a run and we gotta just get full power Jiren out. Let's, um... Let's bring Blue Kaioken and Evolution Blue Vegeta. Just get Rainbow Orb changing. I don't... 17 and 18, they're so bad. Do we, do we think that we get punished for bringing them? Or would we be okay because they have type advantage? I do have a full dodge build on them. I've got 30 dodge on them. Let's... Let's run them. They're type advantage. Let's run them. Let's run them. We'll get rid of them. And we'll bring this loser character. Damn, we're 25 minutes in? Have I just been chirping away? 31 dodge. Looks like I said 4 and 4. That silver is a 1 crit, 5 dodge. And the bronze is a 2 dodge, 1 super attack boost. Okay. It looks like... It looks, it's a fine build. I don't, I don't need to adjust anything for them. It's exactly how we want them, right? As much dodge as we can get. Perfect. Jiren turn 1, which means we could get a turn 5 Jiren out. That's, that's all we're looking for. Oh, okay. Haha. <laughs> you all know what's funny? Um, Jiren is actually going to hurt... Whoops. That was a phantom input, but it's fine. Uh, Jiren is actually going to hurt um, Vegeta a little bit. Because what Jiren is going to do is he's going to um, attack break one of those attacks by Gogeta right there. Jiren only has an attack break on his first turn. All right, perfect. You gotta gotta love getting blocked. Gotta love getting blocked. That twelve key animation for Jiren is pretty rare too, since he doesn't have any additionals built in. All right, this is fine. I would much rather go a little slower through this run to make sure we get full power Jiren out at least once, but. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, Jiren, we really... Uh, he hasn't been too crazy in this. Huh? I mean, I guess I did take him into a very vicious fight for him. I mean, he's an AGL character with only damage reduction going against, like, a double 4 million super tech boss. Maybe I might do... I might do another video for Jiren against Janemba as well. Uh, we haven't seen it, but if we would get Tech UI Goku's domain up, we'd be able to get rid of that bullshit, but. Oh, we'll have the scouter here. Oh, God. It's the second attack. Hmm. Uh, 17 and 18, they can't live this shit, can they? We're gonna have their full support up. We might need to dodge here, I'm not sure. Well, the scouter certainly helped. Helped show us bullshit. Helped show us this garbage-ass turn that Goji just put us into. Hit him a ten system to show normal. Okay, good. Yeah, I gotta make sure to call that out, by the way. I, I gotta make sure you guys know. <laughs> I gotta make sure you guys know. Man. You understood. You understood. Alright, we're dodging. Just wrap that shit up. This is a dodge right here. We're dodging. 31% chance. Easy peasy, dude. Not even a problem. Okay, under 10k from that, I'll take dodge it. Are we alive? They are guarding with damage reduction. This isn't turn one, Gogeta. Okay, we technically we lived. <laughs> okay. That's all, that's, all, that's all we needed. Technically, we're alive. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Nice, dude. Well done. Yeah, perfect. Just get that ass in slot one. I don't want to kill. Gogeta super fast anyway, so I'd rather not. 
Oh, perfect. Orbs fell perfectly for us. Damn, Vegeta, look at that HP regen. All right, I mean, 17 and 18, sure, I'll take it, man. I mean, that was a that's a big boy super attack right there. I mean, I, I wouldn't exactly say that's great tanking, but they are a year old now. That's because they're uh, damage reduction plus uh, guard, right? Okay, good. I mean, we would have revived anyway. But all right, we're looking good, looking good, looking good, looking good. Uh, we have plenty of orbs on this first turn. We got good RNG for Jiren's orb changing, so we are gonna be able to get full power Jiren out. All we need to do is not die here. Oh, Tech UI, please. We just need Tech UI Goku not to fail us. That's it. That's literally it. Uh, we got some rainbows over here. Only two, huh? Only two. Okay, good. Good. Uh, Tech UI, could he live? Probably not, huh? Because he would need to get hit first. And then he'd probably need to need to be guarding to live. So he'd, prob it'd have, he'd have to get hit once and then get hit by a super to live. But even then, I don't know if he'd live. I don't think so. Oh, shit, dude. Whew, thank God. Okay. I just really want to get uh, full power Jiren in the video. What if we get... I mean, so, Full Power Jiren's going to give us a Scouter, by the way. Although, I guess, technically, we're going to have a Scouter from 17, 18 anyway. Damn, we're doing too much damage. No, 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 no. Please. Okay. No, that's all right. Additionals are melees. Yep, so... We're doing way too much damage, huh? Way too much damage. Damn, yeah, I guess we don't really get to prove that Jiren has given us a Scouter. So, here's where Full Power Jiren could potentially suck balls. Oh, we're not going to see it, now. Would be if they if that th this is my problem with full power Jiren is like he's a slot two character when you go full power Jiren, which I don't I don't think a character that we have to double transform for should be slot two. Um, he does give you the scout because like I'm gonna just put his details up on screen. Hold on. <laughs> All right, so we have Jiren out. Um, again, I just want to show his, like, my issues with him. All right, so here's full power Jiren, right? So, huge stats, beautiful. Nice amount of damage reduction, just like Broly, right? Same thing. Um, his first turn, we get a Scouter, and he gets another 11% damage reduction, which is awesome. But, like, then it's just, like, 111% on attacking. He's got the 70% chance to crit, and the extra crit with each super attack performed. Um, extra attack, guaranteed to hit, guaranteed crit. And then this, it's like, I don't get it. They're asking you to get hit by super attacks with him, but, like, he's just, he's a type merchant. He's just living off of the fact that he's AGL against all the really tough SCR bosses. The only reason that this guy works against Goku and Frieza in full power, like in slot one, is because he's AGL. And under 50% HP Goku and Frieza, guess what they do to this guy? They one-shot him. Like, that, that's why, like, his design is very odd to me because this full power is not the greatest against Goku and Frieza. He's designed to just do a massive attack stat rather than a bunch of little attacks, which is good for Goku and Frieza. But, like, he has a scouter for some reason, at, for only for one turn, which the reason it's weird is because Goku and Frieza have the most obvious choreographed super attack ever. Like, you don't need the scouter for that. So, it's just, it's just, it's just weird. Like, he, I think his setup is a little bit odd. See this right here? Turn that into guard. And he's a lot better because you know in Broly. So again, I'm glad in my last tier list I had this because I mean one fight comes out and it just kind of like confirms that, right? For sure. Okay. 
So, all right, we can just go ahead and finish up right here. Uh, do we want to do another run? I mean, we don't need to. By the way, Jiren and UI Goku link up very well together. Um, unfortunately, this is a friend Jiren. It's not link level 10 links, but whatever. Uh, just going to try and conserve a lot of key so that 17 and 18 can get their additional tournament participant support buff. All right, there we go. All right, Jiren, we're at double digits in top one right here, right? Yeah, okay. And then he drops a huge attack stat. Well, I mean, it was a huge attack stat, but we've been through Worldwide, right? Like, that was way more impressive before Worldwide happened. That's a guaranteed crit, by the way. Because now we've got, like, a character that came out in 2019 who could do that. Except he could do that plus 50 million added to the attack. <laughs> Easy attack Broly, right? Uh, yeah, Jiren, hmm. Using Jiren in this fight, it definitely feels like he's fallen off a little bit. I mean, to be fair, though, I was using double Jiren. And, like, Jiren is invincible in that standby. And it's like, by using double Jiren, like, the second Jiren is kind of just a sitting duck against Gogeta. Goji and, and one of those losses that was, like, you know, I stopped the video and say, all right, guys, we've won. I'm just, we're just here to see Jiren, not to win specifically, right? Like, you guys, I do it all the time. And people, like, someone will post it on Twitter, and then someone goes, why the fuck did he put that character there? He's a fucking idiot. It's like, well, I explained it, actually. Thanks. I did explain it. <laughs> all right. Um, I want to see Jiren against Janemba, too. We got to do a video with Jiren against Janemba. This is definitely just a bad matchup for him, which is why I did this one first. But we're definitely going to take Jiren into the Genemba fight as well. Let me know what you guys thought of Jiren. I'll catch y'all next time.